My mom is named Renee Kerrigan, and my dad is named Robert Kerrigan. Okay, and now for the best part, let's talk about your brother. Oh, yeah, my brother is named Connor Kerrigan. He has He is in fourth grade at the school that I am at. He is having a good job in school. Now, do you like to pitch? Yeah, I really like to pitch, especially with my brother. He likes baseball, too, and I do, too. What are you famous for? I am famous for the moonwalk. <laughs> How, who moonwalk came up with Moonwalk king. You did the moonwalk when you got to third base, right? Yep. And everybody expected it. Did they cheer when you did it? Yeah. Yeah. Who came up with that idea? Me. Yeah. How did you figure that out? I don't know. I just wanted to do something cool. Why do you like baseball, Gavin? I just like it because my the Miracle League team, it's because people, kids who, who don't have the right to play a sport actually get to have to play a sport in this league, and that and that's just like me. I, I have... I had a hard time walking, and it just started my life over and over and over, and it made me get happy more and more and more every year. Yeah. What was it like to be part of the team? It just felt like I got an honor to do it, and I know I'm going to do it when... I'm 18, 20, I don't know, whenever, I'm, whenever I can do it. That can be pretty upsetting, and at that point, we had won the National League the year before, and now I was going to the Chicago Cubs, who had been in last place, so that was, that was kind of a downer, too. Yeah, that was really, really sad. <laughs> when you have to <laughs> leave your team, you have to yeah. move away? Yeah. Are we ever, yeah. Do you think that will ever happen on the Miracle League? We'll never trade you to another city, Gavin. No, I'm not getting traded to another city! <laughs> <laughs> You're there forever. Yeah, uh, Miracle League, in, uh, this year at our t on our team, we were cheering even for the other team. We were saying... Good job into the to the other team, and they set it back and i was and I was really proud that they had a good time this year everybody there's no booing at Miracle League, is there no there's no booing there's, there's no, booing. no booing okay, so on the first day I went to Miracle League, I saw him and I said, "Hi, what's your name and he said, Chris Cordrick and then the game the game that he could come we got we got a little Gatorade and it was actually free because her mom let us have free Gatorade and Chris Chris likes me and my brother it's just really happy to have a friend who likes baseball and and it makes me happy again Oh, I think you? baseball is the best game in the world, and I and uh, I applaud all the efforts to allow everyone to play. Did you get to meet Chuck Gatica from Channel 4 News, too? Oh, yeah. I got to go on an interview, too. It was, I was, he just came up to me and said, you want to be a TV star? And I was like, and I, and I just said, yes, I want to be one. And he said, well, you're in luck because you, you're going to get interviewed. And I was like, yay! And you were on TV. Yeah. What did you tell, what did you say? Do you remember? Oh, yeah. I said, I remember me saying that, Chuck, you were, this is, baseball is going to be my future. It's going to be your That's future. That's the only thing I remember. Well, baseball will always be a part of my life. <laughs> But when I was too. when I was your age, I used to dream all the time of playing in the big leagues. Yeah. And don't lose that dream. It's it's a fun dream to have and and to get as good as you can get. 
Don't worry, it'll just be sitting in my brain. Maybe we could uh do some more get more kids for next season and we could do like baseball in a little dome. Oh, you know what? Baseball. Let's tell people that. All we need is a lot of money to build a dome, and then we can play winter baseball. Yeah, you can Please. play all winter. Please give contribute us. to the Gavin. We'll even call it the Gavin Dome if we can get a lot of money. Please. Give it, probably, us. it probably costs about $100,000, right? Like, this could be like the commercial. Please, give give the Gavin Dome. Okay. What, you, what would you like to say there? Chris, if you are watching... If you are listening or watching, please, please, on Facebook, send a note. And don't worry, I will always be your friend. You'll always be his friend. Thank you. All right, we're going to end up end with the only song that we could play, and that's Don't Stop Believing by Journey. Thank you, guys. Thank you.